you think of alpacas? They're adorable. Yeah. I love them. Do you ever really think of them, though? Think of alpacas. No. Of course. <laughs> Maybe you should. They are sweet. They are adorable. They make the best clothes. For instance, I am sporting a fine alpaca tie today. Let me be clear, though. You shave them to get the clothes. They live. They love it. Lewis and Clark continue the adventures this morning on an alpaca farm enjoying these very interesting animals. Yeah, so uh, you're trying to look like a farmer? Yeah. Going in Rome. Yeah. You know what I mean? Well, we well gonna... we're not in Rome. We're in McClenny. McClenny. Yeah. And it's a farm uh, <laughs> unlike anything I've ever seen. It is a sweet farm. Adorable. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm on a mission from God. <laughs> Is that right? No greater mission, really, for Louise Elliott. I woke up one morning and thought, girl, you are not getting any younger. If you think you're ever going to have an alpaca farm, you dang sure better get out there and buy some alpacas. I did. She can't explain the love. It's just something she says she always had. I don't know. It's a soul. They're my soul animal. Soul animal. They're my spirit animal. Oh. Welcome to their world. You go ahead and make direct eye contact with one, noticing their long, full eyelashes, their incredible hairstyles, the charming underbite. You kind of just get the love. Yes. Yes. This is great. Oh. oh. <laughs> How'd that feel? Oh, that was great. Now, if you meet her with your head and not your hand, she will love you more. What do you, you're with her, you're uh -huh. head. Put your head down to her. Oh, see. Native to South America, namely Peru, Louise opened up Acoyo Acres Farms in McClenny to educate people about the animals she loves and also sell some fiber, which is the proper term for the soft hair you shear Ooh. off their back. You could get a hat, a scarf, gloves, socks. I, have, I do a lot of baby items because they are hypoallergenic. And it is incredibly soft. I love you. I love them. But more than anything, Louise just loves being their mama. You need to, you need to chill. You need to chill. You need to chill. You need to chill. Oh, look, look, look. That's Kuzma. Kuzma is Max's half brother, and he's a clown. What, what am I supposed to do? Just sit here and hold that. Okay. 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 Good luck. All right, girl. Go get it. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Everybody. No, no, no. Oh, oh my goodness. Here, you want some juice? I preferred you, Jess. <laughs> this is my kind of farm. <laughs> I like this. Hi. It's okay. It's okay. I love this place. She takes them around to public events, and you can visit the farm by appointment to get that oh! alpaca dance up on you treatment, too. <laughs> so they're, in essence, the perfect animal. Oh. Back and forth. Coyo Acres alpacas. Right. There you go. That's easy enough. Triple A. Their hair is great. Oh my God, that's such a great thing to do with the kids. Mm -hmm. I love it. Absolutely, yeah. and uh, when I say that she she loves those animals, yeah, they are the happiest alpacas. I mean, in the <laughs> world, she's out there. Most of the sad ones. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, you just wonder, you know, sometimes. But she takes such great care of them, and. Uh, and you heard her talk to them. She just talks to them like they're her babies. Chill out, babies. Yeah, we heard that. <laughs> All right. Uh, Good Morning Jacksonville continues in just two minutes.